Uh, growing up in Mississippi, my prayer was, for as long as I can remember, God, use me. Use me. Use this life. I don't know what the future holds for me, but I know that there is a vision for my life that is greater than my imagination can hold. Use me. Use me. What would you have me to do? And that dream, that desire, that prayer brought me somehow to television. And she's going to learn that this life will hit you hard in the face, wait for you to get back up just so it can kick you in the stomach, but getting the wind knocked out of you is the only way to remind your lungs how much they like the taste of air. If, if we want to give all of our children a foundation for their dreams and opportunities worthy of their promise, if, if we want to give them that sense of limitless possibility, that belief that here in America, there is always something better out there if you're willing to work for it, then we must work like never before. To those waiting with bated breath for that favorite media catchphrase, the U-turn, I have only one thing to say. You turn if you want to. The ladies not for turning. You might never fail on the scale I did, but some failure in life is inevitable. It is impossible to live without failing at something, unless you live so cautiously that you might as well not have lived at all in which case you fail by default. Each of us must truly be a woman in the world. We need to be as fearless as the women whose stories you have applauded, as committed as the dissidents and activists you have heard from, as audacious as those who start movements for peace, when all seems lost. Together, I do believe it is part of the American mission to ensure that people everywhere, women and men alike, finally have the opportunity to live up to their own God-given potential.